everybody, Indy Dirk here, back with another one-handed guitar tutorial. Today we're going to be covering D major, as you'll see up here on the screen. I want to go really in depth with this chord with you today, so we're going to talk about finger placement and the notes that are in the chord, and you guys can follow along right up here. I want to note that if you're a left-handed player, there should be a link in the description to download the chart that I've made for the left-handed version of these chords. Alright, with that said, let's hop right in. So our D major is played on the, the high four strings, okay? We don't use the five and the six string on this chord, okay? So uh, the fourth string on your guitar is a D. You'll see that noted right up here. And then we're going to put our ring finger, okay? Our ring finger on the third string, the second fret, okay? And then we're going to put our index finger on the second string, the third fret. And then our pinky is going to be used on the first string, the second fret, okay? And that's our D chord. Now we play from the fourth string down. Okay, so you get that nice D chord sound. And that's your D chord. Now let's real quickly go through what notes make up this chord, okay? And again, keep in mind that I'm not using my five and six strings. Those are being muted. Starting with the fourth string, we have a D, and that's our root note, meaning the, the lowest note and the note that we hit first on a downstroke. The G string, the third string, is an A, and that's, uh, that's fretted by your, your ring finger. The second string is a D, and that's fretted by your index finger on the third fret. And then the high E string is the F sharp, fretted by your pinky on the second fret. So. D, A, D, F sharp. Again, D, A, D, F sharp. Okay? Now, it's real good to get used to fretting these chords in this manner because for 99% of transitions, this is the best way that I could think to fret these chords. Like, a lot of times from the D, you'll go to the G, or something else, and if you have your fingers in what's indicated up here, uh, it'll transition real smoothly to your next chord. So, with that said, this is D major. Practice, practice, practice. Hope you guys get this one down, and then we'll move on to A major. All right, thanks so much. If you like this video, let me know. Comment and subscribe, and as always, ask any questions that you may have. Thank you.